What is up, you beautiful people? Dylan here, back with another video. Today, today we're getting lost on purpose. Don't uh, don't really have a plan. No uh, nowhere to go, nowhere to be. We're just enjoying this gorgeous weather. It's like 70s, sunny. Feels super nice out. So. Going on a little ride. Don't know where, don't know where we're gonna end up. The goal, if, if we can uh, make it happen, is to have to use my GPS to get back home. That's pretty hard, because I know the area quite well. But, you know, I don't go straight that often. So, that's where we're going. We're gonna see what, uh, what we can find. Uh, it's 345 so we're gonna need some dinner in a little bit got pretty much a full tank so hopefully you can make a, a fun little fun little video that y'all will enjoy see so this light this turns on to college I always go there because so you take that road to go to Walmart and I'm Always going to Walmart. Okay, so this is North River Road. Not sure what's down here. So I turn, uh, I turn 22 next month, which is wild. I mean, not really wild. It's not like, it's not a big birthday. But, you know. Getting, getting old. Been out of high school for almost four years now. It's, uh, this, this spring will be my, uh, four, four year mark. My sister graduates college. Be out of the Marine Corps. There's no way that, oh my god, I think this is Douglas. This looks like Douglas. If straight brings me to Douglas, and I don't, don't know where we're, uh, they, oh, <laughs> okay. This is Douglas. All right. Well, we're going to go straight then. Oh, yeah. We'll see where this brings me. Yeah, I didn't know that. Yeah, uh, so as I was saying before we, uh, before I stopped talking there, turning 22. Nikolai graduates. I'll be getting out of the Marine Corps next year. Exciting, exciting things happen, and we are at a Dead end. So much for going straight. What is that? Authorized personnel. Wake. Well, I don't think I'm authorized. Okay. So we'll go this way. TGIF plane right now. It's a bop. Oh, I guess we'll go right. Now, uh, birthday, birthday plans. Do I have any? No. Uh, I don't. The last. So, let's see. I turned 19, turned 19 in boot camp. Uh, that was on a Sunday. So my uh, my birthday celebration for that was going to church. Um, last year, I turned 21. Wait, no, that doesn't make sense. Well, yeah, last year I turned 21, but the year prior, I, I was 20. What'd I do? Probably nothing. Uh, I think I might have been working. 
Last year, 21, uh, went to Texas Roadhouse and had some Mike's, uh, Mike's Lemonade. That was, uh, that was my big, uh, celebration for 21. So, you know, 22, I don't know, I might get some ice cream cake. I, uh, I do like ice cream cakes. So that might be our, uh, celebration this year. We'll see, we'll see. Okay, uh, we're going, we're going to try straight again. I don't think I know. Oh, what are they doing? Walking the whole lane. Oh, we have to merge. Um, I don't think I've gone straight before, because I know, so right's going to bring, right brings you out to 76, or 78, something, something like that. That'll, that'll bring you out there. Straight, not really too sure. I feel like we're just on some back road that goes along the 78. And we'll probably just pop out there. What? Dude, if... What, what is this road? Old Grove. No idea. I guess we're gonna head to the beach. <laughs> Do I have anywhere else? No, I like the beach. So, I uh, went in a sauna for the first time today. So, let's uh, I'll paint a picture. I uh, worked out, killed my chest. And then, I ran, ran a mile. Um, and I want to try out the sauna. So I go in there, and it is so hard to breathe. It is ridiculous. How hard it was to breathe. Granted, it might have just been because it's my first time in there. And I'm just not used to the heat, or what, but it was ridiculous. I spent five minutes in there, and I got out. Granted, you're only supposed to spend five to ten minutes, so we were in our recommended time. The uh, lovely Oceanside Airport hit a plane crash. Not too long ago. Sadly, there was a fatality. It was a skydiving plane. I had a whole uh, investigation. Don't know what happened with it, but. I was talking to some people at the crash. I think they said that there's been like six in the past few years, which. That's a, it's quite a lot. If you 
you're uh, asking me. Oh, no worries. Thank you. You're, you're a gem. Ugh. Well, I know what I might I, I'll probably end up going getting a tattoo. That's, uh... I got, uh, I got some more ideas, so... Well, uh... Oh, yeah, gotta get that. Gotta get the lean. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, yeah, where you are? Speed racer. <laughs> uh, I'm thinking about an American Eagle. Uh, with, like, the wings cresting. I don't know if cresting is the right... The right word I'm looking for. But going around, like, my knee. So, it's like... It'll cover... The upper portion of my shin. And then up around the knee. On the, uh... On the left side. It's already got... I got a Grim Reaper on my right shin. I have a lion on my thigh. Right thigh. Got an astronaut on my left pec. I got my bass sleeve. I got a ghost holding a pizza box on my right arm. And then uh, mountains, which was my first tattoo. Got that with Nicolette. If y'all watched last, uh, our last video we had, what's up big dog? Um, this is, uh, downtown Oceanside. Very familiar with this area. Got to we're gonna go down to the beach. Check out the waves, see how the, uh, what are they doing? See how the ways are. We uh we actually got rain uh for the first time in I want to say six months. Could be an exaggeration, but I highly doubt it is. Yeah. So rain this past weekend, um, which was amazing because I mean, when you don't see rain for that long, it's it's a nice uh, refreshing experience because it's. Always sunny and hot here. The uh, the car got a nice wash from the rain because it was caked in uh caked in dirt. I park in a dirt lot for work, so every day I'm just putting more and more dirt on it. Oh, the waves are non-existent. What is going on here? Hey, God. Oh, there's probably a surf competition coming up. French coat guy. He's like a a local celebrity. He um <laughs> I don't I I 
haven't seen him recently, but hopefully he's still alive. He's an older gentleman, and he wears a trench coat and goes swimming in the ocean. So, if y'all want something to watch, it's, uh, it's pretty interesting, the trench coat guy. Um, he, uh, this, this beach, too. So, I've seen him a few times. Not, uh, not recently, though. Granted, I'm not, I'm not down here all the time, so. I haven't really came out here this summer. Granted, summer's over, but. Now, do I go into Carlsbad, or what do I do? I don't know. Wisconsin, we are far away from there. Because, you know, I uh, didn't, don't have any plans for dinner. And Angela's is always, always solid. Um, I don't, I've been wanting to try something uh, different there, so I might give that a go tonight. Ooh, that, huh. these dips are huge, and they just pop out of nowhere. See, so yeah, I, I, I don't know. So I want to get a beach house eventually, right? But I don't know how people can live here. I mean, I'm not even saying I want to get one out here, but I want to get one. But in a like a tourist destination, so people don't know how to drive. They don't know how to act. And their their common sense just goes away. So I don't, I guess if it's, if it's not like my full-time house, it won't really be an issue. Cause I, it'll, it'll be like a little vacay every, every now and again. So, I don't know what point I was trying to make there. I, I just talked myself out of whatever, whatever wherever that was going. Alright, so if you're, uh, here's some, uh, here's some tourist tips if you're ever in the Carlsbad area. That sign, sign is, uh, it's a prime, prime tourist picture, okay? You, uh, you go right in the middle here. Fuckers take it all the time. Don't know what this spot is called, but I call it the grass patch. Right there, uh, Friday, Saturdays, always popping. Right now, it's super empty. It is Wednesday? Yeah, it's Wednesday. It's Wednesday, so. But uh, it's a nice, nice shot. It's got the uh, overview of the grass, or not the, not the grass. <laughs> You're on the grass. Uh, the ocean. Got a nice, nice high view of the ocean, so that's, it looks nice. And then uh, we'll we'll get one more. Oh, what's that, dude? We'll get uh one more spot for you. It's sort of like the grass spot, but it uh it's a little better, I'd say. We're uh, we're coming up to it. So just past uh what's that say? Cur Curzo, Curzo driver. You can either pull over here or uh, down further, which is what I'd recommend because it's. Uh, I don't even know if it's less crowded down there, but right, uh, right before this light, it's. What? Uh, yeah, some. You get your your nice little Instagram pictures here. Uh, so you got, you got this whole area. And you pull off and go there. So those are three, three 
free Instagram spots if you're ever in the, uh, the Carlsbad area. I'm sure there's plenty more, but those are some big ones that I know about. Right, we're gonna talk about uh, Purple Hearts for a minute. So, uh, I have not seen the movie. Okay. Um, why? Because I have no desire to watch it. Not a big movie guy, first of all. So. But, uh, a little, little gist of it. It's uh, a Marine getting married to get hit PAH. Uh, he gets caught. He gets involved with some drug dealer or something. Something of that nature. And, uh, and yeah. I guess marriages in the Marine Corps have gone up like over 30 something percent. Which is a lot. Cause guys right now they get they get married way too young as it is. Uh I let's see. Since so I've I've been in three years, just over. And I personally know of Some of them not even 20. So, if my uh, if my marine my marine buddies are watching this, okay, be smart. Don't uh, don't rush into things. You got your you got your life ahead of you. Enjoy it. Don't, uh, don't get married for money. Words of advice. Dylan Horhan. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's that cop. Hi. Just looking for him. Super jealous of my, uh, my folks that got seasons. Because September, that, uh, means it's going to be fall. And the leaves changing color is probably one of my favorite things about fall. And we have palm trees, pretty much. So, I don't get to see anything change color. Blue skies, green palm trees. And that's about it. I'm not, granted, the weather's nice. But, it, uh, I, I like when it gets cold, sweatshirt weather, get your, uh, m mobbing, mobbing down a back road with your, uh, windows down, blasting some country. It's just a, that's just the vibe. Out here, yeah, it, you can do that. It's not the same, so. Jealous, jealous of y'all. These kids on their e-bikes are maniacs. Like, um, if if I include it in the video, there's some dude that ran the red light right in front of me. And then I'm pretty sure they ran another red light after that. They have no regard for the rules of the road. Granted, they're like 12, but... Those things go fast. You get hit by a car, you're, uh, you're not gonna have a good day. All right, guys. Thanks for watching my video. I'm gonna uh, go ahead and end this off. I'll uh, see y'all next time.